crisp, clear afternoon. January 9th, just after the new year. It's a beautiful day in Gingerbreadville. The gingerbread that curls together stays together. Nothing can shake the foundation of this neighborhood. Except... The lone survivor. <laughs> Auditionee number six. Auditionee number six. Please come to the room. Good afternoon, miss. I am Director Gustov. Name, please. Tiffany. Well, Miss Tiffany, tell me about your acting history. I enjoyed being the pink Power Ranger. That was a really great experience for me. How long were you on the Power Rangers show? Oh, oh, I wasn't. At a amusement park? No. At a drag bar? Backyard Productions. Big shot, really. Up and coming, up and coming, up and coming. Been up and coming for about 20 years now. Been working with them since I was about five. Unfortunately, they make you retire at 12. So it's been a while since I've been in work, but it, it is definitely my most prestigious work. Well, your history matters not. Your age, your sex, your nationality, nothing matters more. Then can you be? Godzilla. You have one chance. Give me the best Godzilla you can imagine. Imagine that you, you are the kaiju that has come to wreak destruction upon Tokyo. Auditionee number 12. Did I say you could enter? State your name for the record. Hi, my name's Monique. What are your previous acting experiences? Well, I have a lot of experience at my all women's private small junior college. It used to be a finishing school, you see, and I worked with two separate professors and I did three shows a year and we even did outreach shows where we would invite the community to come in and really experience liberal arts. 
what were your activism experiences? Charity work, activism, protests. transition center for people that were moving from one place to another. Do you have any experience in feminism? Well, I mean, I attended uh, Junior's Women's College and also uh, All Girls High School. So like we had seminars all the time about, you know, women, their bodies, how there are bodies, oddly enough. Are you ready? Could possibly be the first ever female Godzilla. I've always wanted to be the first ever something, so yeah. You understand the weighted galleys? Yeah, totally. Like, my dad watches Godzilla. No, that I have worked hard to come up in this industry, and if I give you this position, understand it is my name. Producer Natalia! On that screen next to yours. And I need you to understand that as women, we must prevail any corners. Like, I totally get it. I really do. And also, like, as producer, producer Natalia, your name would be above mine because you would be, like, the ultimate example to little girls everywhere. Thank you, you may leave. Wait! Do you not want me to, like, be Godzilla? You know what? I will allow it. Prove to me how you can be the best. First female Godzilla. <clears throat> Was that okay? You may leave. We will call you if, if we feel like calling you. Well, thank you so much for the opportunity. Even if I, like, don't get the role, producer Natalia, I know you're going places. It was just an honor to meet you. Assistant! Yes, yes, yes. Prepare her sheet for call back. Wait. Wait. Too much. Too much. Oh, shit. She changes, she changes the angle. She, she decides. She decides. Natalia decides where she go. Hold on. Natalia is taller than I thought. <laughs> Natalia is not five foot two. No, Natalia is five foot four. And a half. Oh, and a half. And a half. Oh, wow. I got cocoa powder everywhere. Oh, you <laughs> launched the That's why I started laughing. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's all over my leg. It's all over my table. My it's all over the floor. Is it in your wine? No, your wine is safe. I didn't get that. Okay, okay. I need a wash rag. Okay. I need all of the filming equipment out of my cocoa powder's trail. It's like a trail of gingerbread blood. Yeah, I know it's all over my leg. It's like all the way up. Oh, it's on my shirt. It's on my arm. I am one with my victims. Cinderella, Cinderella, won't you clean up others' messes? Uh, these were your messes. I know, but I'm not Cinderella now, am I? Why are you spraying your pants? Because then I can wash my pants. I'm so happy that's on film. This actually worked. Oh my God, look. <laughs> what is this miracle? Because this stuff worked. It's Mrs. Myers. Well, good job, Mrs. Just... Myers. Did you know that you could do laundry? You know what I'm doing though? Mm -hmm. I'm just grouting your tile for you. Yeah. It's just, it's in the grout now. When it gets humid out, you can smell the cocoa. Oh, my favorite is randomly, I'll just get whiffs of hot cocoa, like rotten hot cocoa. Mm, yeah, didn't you cast knock a bunch of it over? Mm-hmm. They knocked More over. More than once, right? They've knocked over cups of hot cocoa on multiple occasions and we clean it out. But anytime it gets real humid, and if I'm down there doing yoga, just get a whiff of like rotten hot cocoa, which smells like just like spoiled milk and chocolate. It's gross. All right, I think I'm ready 
waiting for my stepmother to come home. No, I'm not. Don't come home. No, I'm not. Don't come home. Oh my god. It's underneath this chair. I feel like I feel like a uh, 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 Mr. Incredible when he just lifted up for through the vacuum under. Yeah. Oh, so strong. I'm Shia. I was in the school play. Boom. Were you a tree? Were you a shrub? Were you the moon? I was actually never in the school play. That was a lie. I should have <laughs> on my resume.